Hi, I'm Roberta Fernandez, a board-certified hypnotist in Eden Prairie, Minnesota, at the Fair Hypnosis Center. After our post last week, a few of you have asked, who is this Mesmer guy? Well, Franz Anton Mesmer is considered to be one of the modern fathers of hypnosis, and this was back in the early to mid-1700s. Uh, Mesmer was gaining a lot of popularity for his abilities to cure certain diseases and people and make them better. And he moved to Paris and he was really um, drawn in by the upper hierarchy of Par uh, Parisians at the time, the people with money and clout, and they were making great claims about Mesmer. Well, King Louis the 16th at the time wasn't so crazy about him, even though his wife was. And he set out a committee to investigate Mesmer. So it was because of this panel that Louis XVI got together that Ben Franklin was on that gave us our tie that we talked about last week. But let's talk a little bit about what Mesmer contributed. At the time, the science of the time, Mesmer felt that the powers, the curative powers he, he claimed that he had, had to do with magnetic force and magnets, and he used those in his so-called healings. And that's where the term animal magnetism came about. The term mesmerize also came from Mesmer. He would do what we now consider to be hypnotic techniques with individuals and with groups and people were said to be mesmerized by him. So, so Mesmer was really quite an interesting character. He was very flamboyant, and in his group sessions he wore capes and did candles, and um, I'm sure put on quite a spectacle for the time. Um, whether his techniques were effective or not, well, it depends on who you listen to in the history books. So I'm Roberta Fernandez, helping you take back control by unlocking the power of your mind to reach your goals of any kind.